Hello guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to use Grub Customizer. Grub Customizer is an easy tool which allows you to customize your Grub menu. I have Grub Customizer already installed in my system. Once you have finished installing, open up your terminal and under the command Grub hyphen customizer you will be prompted for entering the password. So this is Grub Customizer. One of the basic things that you can do here is you can change the name of the operating system appearing in the Grub menu. So I'm going to change my name of Ubuntu. To change, uh, select, uh, double click on it and enter the new name. And once you're finished, press enter. So uh, as we can see, the name is changed. Another thing that you can do is you can select which all operating system should appear in your grub menu. If you don't want an operating system to appear in your grub menu, just deselect them. And if you want them to appear again, just select them again. Now we're going to preferences. Under the general tab, you can see an option called default entry. This determines which operating system your system should automatically boot into. Now the predefined one is Ubuntu. I could change that to anything. Or I have another option for selecting the previously booted entry. If you select this option, the operating system you have previously booted would automatically be booted up. And I could set the timeout settings here. Change them. Now that's all here. Now I'm going to the appearance tab. First you can select a custom resolution for your grab menu. 1024 into 768 then you can select the colors for the text appearing in the grub menu selecting uh, red for normal text uh, let the background of the normal text be yellow highlighted one let it be blue and uh, uh, let the background of the highlighted text be transparent now under background image you can select a background image for your grub menu mm, go into USR share backgrounds and um, selecting small plus you can see a preview here now I'm moving to the advanced tab you can see a whole list of options here so these are the options you find in the configuration file of grub so you can make changes here itself if you want to change the value you could do it here just double click on it enter the new value and press enter you could also select and deselect uh, an option once you're finished, uh, click close. Now for all your custom configuration to be saved, uh, click on save. All your custom configuration has been successfully saved. It's a time for testing. Go for a reboot and see a new custom grub menu. And uh, thanks for watching.